already destroyed 80 computers with computer viruses and in this video I am going to be destroying the 90th computer. No hesitation, let's go ahead and get this video started. This right here is the infamous USB that's loaded up with computer viruses. If you guys have been enjoying this series, go ahead and hit the like button so I can make part 10 and onwards. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. I mean, if you're on part 9 right now and you haven't subscribed to the channel, I don't even know what you're doing, but go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Without any further hesitation, let's go ahead and get this video started. So we have Windows 11 open on the computer. We're gonna go into the virus and threat protection settings and turn the real-time protection off on my computer. We're gonna disconnect from my internet. Now we're gonna pop in the USB to see which computer virus we're gonna open first. The first computer virus that we're gonna open up is called version 1.0. If you wanna allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device, version 1.0.exe. Let's go ahead and hit yes. Oh wow, whoa. I want to warn you in advance because you are trying to run a very destructive computer malware. Please install a virtual machine to run the program. Do not run this program on a physical computer. If you run this program, it will damage all of your data. I am not responsible for any damage. Do you want to run this malware on this device? If you click only once on the run button, the malware will start immediately. Let's go ahead and hit run. No chance. What? You must restart your computer. What? <laughs> what? So my computer just automatically restarted out of nowhere. Okay, so we have the Windows logo. So far, so good. What? Oh, okay, so that's what my Windows looks like right now. What the hell? Bro, what is this? It doesn't look like that much of a destructive computer virus, but we all know how these computer viruses work. They could all be running in the background. They could just be infiltrating every other device you have in your house that is connected to your Wi-Fi. My mouse is really weird right now. Like you can see it. Since the computer is still usable, we're gonna stick the USB back into the computer to see which other computer viruses we have. Getting the video started off with something simple. Now we're moving on to the ransomwares. The next computer virus that we're gonna take a look at is called the Worm Locker Ransomware. Worm Locker 2.0 as administrator all your files documents videos pictures and other files have been encrypted with a special algorithm if you want the files back you have to send a pay fee card code to the email worm locker 789 that's what my computer looks like right now after sending the amount of 50 euros you will receive a 50 code euros oh so the computer has been absolutely bamboozled i forgot to take out the usb which i'm going to just remove it right now i don't even have the windows bar on the bottom of the screen but i do have a pretty powerful function here where i can just go to the top actions and hit reset start yes after sending the amount of 50 euros you will receive a decrypt code to unlock all files actions other files shut have down been encrypted with a special algorithm if you want the files back you have to send a pay fee card code to the email worm lock it says what happens if i don't pay if you do not pay by a certain time or turn off the computer all your data will be permanently deleted and now the windows logo appeared it's telling me my computer was not going to restart pro oh Oh no, if you see this on the screen, you probably misread the instructions. At this point, you must reinstall an operating system. All your files will no longer be repairable. There is no possibility of escape. How to get rid of the screen? Method one, the easiest way is to reinstall the operating system using the installation media. Oh my God. Oh bro, this is, this is a nightmare. So we're gonna open that computer, reveal it in the finder and send it to the shadow realm. And now it's gone forever. We're gonna open up the next instance of Windows 11 so we could download another computer virus. The next computer virus that we're gonna open up is called ransomware 3.0. You want to allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? Ransomware3.0.exe, yes. What? 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 Every file on my left side got encrypted. Your files have been encrypted and you are now a victim of Ransomware 3.0. You can still recover your files, but you will have to pay for a special key that allows you to decrypt your files. You can buy the decryption key from our email address. Be sure not to disable or modify encrypted files. If you do, your files will no longer be recoverable. Do not turn off your computer either. Bitcoin accepted here. So I have to send what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Decrypt. It has to work. Incorrect key. I have two hours and 58 minutes until I have to make this transaction. Otherwise, every single file on this computer is going to be absolutely obliterated. Let's go ahead and hit restart on the computer anyways to see what would happen. Closing three apps and restart anyway. Let's go ahead and do it. So the computer is restarting. We got a Windows logo. This is a good thing. Crypto NWO. Subscribe to the channel if you're enjoying the video. Ransomware 3.0. It looks like the computer is perfectly fine. All of my files. Oh, they're restarting my computer. It's at 60% complete. Oh, this is so bad. So my computer restarted and then it just completely gave me the blue screen of death. If you guys enjoy the blue screen of death, then you're going to really enjoy the black screen of death because the next... Com oh, Windows restarted. Is it going to keep doing that? I'm not touching anything. Hands are over here. Everything is looking good. 
Oh, this is a nightmare. So my computer has absolutely been bamboozled by this computer virus. Every single time it restarts, it's gonna give me the blue screen of death. Oh, what the hell? I'm getting a please wait icon on the bottom. That's not good. It looks like Windows didn't load properly. See advanced to repair options, continue and use Windows 11. Crypto NW, oh, this is good. Now I'm just staying away from my computer. I'm staying away from my computer, showing you guys that my hand, one hand is on this iPhone. The other hand is right in front of the camera. I'm not doing anything. And look at that. Your device just ran into a problem and needs to restart. This computer has been absolutely Absolutely bamboozled. Now we're gonna go ahead and open up the next instance of Windows 11 so we could download another computer virus. Look at that, Crypto NWO, as if nothing even happened to my computer. I know you guys really enjoy those computer viruses that give you the blue screen of death, but the next computer virus that we're gonna open is called the WinLocker V6 Black Screen of Death. This one here is a pretty interesting computer virus because it's another ransomware. We're gonna right click it, run as administrator. If you wanna allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device, WinLocker V6 Black Screen of Death, yes. What? Bro, you saw that, right? What if I tried to restart the computer? It didn't really say anything was happening to my computer, but we're gonna restart it anyways. Attention, your computer maybe is infected with an virus. Please call the number provided to get immediately professional help. You will be guide in the removal of any potential malware or adware. Call now immediately. Your security may be at risk. A problem has been detected and Windows has been shut down to prevent damage to your computer. So we're gonna hit actions, restart. It said the black screen of death virus, but yo, my computer has been eaten alive. Bro, what in God's green planet? Attention, your computer maybe is infected with an virus. Zeus was detected and put in quarantine. Zeus is a very dangerous software used by criminals to steal personal data such as credit card information, access to banking accounts, passwords to social media, and emails. Shut down. We're gonna restart the computer one more time. We're gonna see if Attention. it's gonna work. Your computer maybe isn't. So that computer has been absolutely obliterated by the WinLocker V2. We're gonna reveal that computer in the finder and then we're gonna send it to the Shadow Realm. And now that computer is gone forever. The next computer virus that we're gonna open, I know you guys are really gonna like this is the Mandela virus. Now warning, this one is pretty creepy. It's considered a creepy pasta Trojan. You're really gonna like it. Do you wanna allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device, Mandela.exe? Yes. This program you were trying to open is malicious malware. If you have run this malware on physical hardware, shut down quickly. Be aware that this malware can damage personal files and system components. It's gonna damage system components. Oh my God. I am not responsible for any damages. Look at that button. We're gonna hit run. What? Are you really sure you want to run this malware? This is the last warning. Yes. Oh, like this is what my computer actually looks like right now, bro. What the hell? Oh, okay. It flashes. It's flashing white. It's good. What happened to my computer? Hello? That just bothered me. What the hell? Oh my god. Bro, what the hell? Nothing is worse, worth the risk. Oh my god. My computer has been absolutely bamboozled by this virus. Oh, oh. Okay, it's restarting. This is good. Oh my god. Malware, short, short, quote, malicious software. Unquote is a type of software designed to harm or exploit computer systems, networks, and devices. Malware can take many forms, including virus. The system is shutting down. Please save all work in progress and log, lo log off. Any unsaved changes will be lost. Somewhere, malware is dangerous because it can cause significant harm to individuals, organizations, and even entire countries. Use antivirus and anti-malware software. Installing antivirus and anti-malware software on your computer and devices is an essential to protect that from malware. Make oh my god. Software up to date to ensure it What is this? Treats. Be cautious of suspicious emails and websites. Malware can be spread through phishing emails and malicious websites. Be cautious of emails from unknown senders and don't click. Oh my god. If you suspect that your computer is infected with malware, contact cyber so Bro, this is the scariest computer virus I've ever s seen in my life. 
What is this? Nothing is worth the risk. What the hell? It's restarting again. This is the second restart this computer virus has initiated on my computer. What in God's green planet? My hand's not touching the computer. I'm actually very far away. Oh bro, this is a nightmare. What if I restart the computer? Closing two apps and restarting. Nothing is worth the risk. Restart anyway. I don't even want to look at the computer. I don't even want to look at the computer. If you guys want to see the entire creepypasta virus, hit the like button. Let me know in the comment section. Hit subscribe. We're not done this video because right now it says press any key to boot from. Oh, so we just destroyed the boot sector of the computer. The thing that is responsible for your computer turning on when you press the power button and it tells your computer, yo fam, remember what you are? You're a PC. That has been destroyed right in front of me right now. But like I said, if you guys want to see the entire Mandela virus, let me know in the comment section and please hit the like button. Oh, please hit the like button. I keep these videos as short as I possibly can and the virus was running a little too long. So so if you guys want to see the entire video, the Mandela virus, let me know in the comment section because I kind of want to take a look at that virus. So we're starting another instance of Windows 11. The next computer virus that we're going to open up is called the Destructive Trojan. Plain and simple. We're going to click it. Application, run as administrator. Do you want to allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? Yes. Are you sure you really want to run this program? This is malicious software. Click yes to continue. Yes. This is the last warning. If you run this program, your computer will get a lot of damage. Yes. Nothing's happening so far. YouTube channel. Yo, you guys are gonna have to let me know whose channel that is. How to cut leg. No, 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 no. It's opening up another. Oh! Oh my god, this reminds me of Mems. Oh my god, what the hell is this? This is the destructive Trojan. Reminds me of Mems. If you guys are liking this, let me know in the comment section. What the hell? Oh, the screen glitch is bad. Oh, the screen glitch is really bad. Cyber Soldier YouTube. Subscribe to Cyber Soldier, creator of the virus. Shout out to Cyber Soldier. He also created the Mandela virus. What is it searching right now on YouTube? What is this? We're on our MacBook right now. We're gonna go to the top, top, top of our MacBook, hit actions and hit restart. Yes. Virus last, virus destructive, restart anyway. And it's gonna, oh, your device ran into a problem and needs to restart. We're just collecting some error info and then we'll restart it for you, 44% complete. What do we learn from this? When we have a computer virus, the last thing you wanna do when you have a computer virus initiating on your computer is restart your computer because this is gonna happen. Your PC needs to be repaired. Press enter to try again, enter, what is, ah! Oh! <laughs> I didn't even do that. So my computer has been absolutely obliterated by the destructive Trojan. The next computer virus that we're gonna open up is called Neurozyme. Do you wanna allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? Yes. This is malware, run. I love it when it's plain and simple like that. Let's go ahead and hit yes. What? Are you sure it will overwrite the boot record and contains flashing lights not for the epileptic? You have been warned even throughout the video. Oh, Neurozyme is obliterating the computer. This is what my PC looks like right now. Oh dear Lord. GDI viruses, that's what these viruses are called. GDI viruses are absolute nightmares. Take a look at the screen right now. This is what my actual PC looks like. Bro. Is that even, this is not even legal. I would sue the person that returned my computer like this to me. Oh my God. Oh dear Lord. Bro, this is one of the craziest computer viruses I have ever seen. The Neurozyme virus. It's saying a bunch of flashes on the screen. You guys are gonna have to tell me what that says. Oh dear God. Bro, this is absolutely one of the most destructive computer viruses I've ever seen. Look at this. Fam. <laughs> Yo, this slaps. So you can't really see what I'm holding in my hand right now, but what you could see is the subscribe button. Have you hit the subscribe button yet? Go ahead and hit subscribe. We've made nine of these computer virus videos and number 10 is going to be absolutely insane. So make sure you're subscribed for when number 10 is gonna be released. It's gonna be absolutely insane. But that's all I wanted to say. Let's go ahead and get back to the video. These computer viruses, the GDI viruses are by far my favorite computer viruses because of these effects and because of the music. I'm sure a lot of you guys agree. Oh, it's saying Neurozyme now. Now it's showing the name of the virus just flashing up on the screen, doing it really quickly. I'm sure if you pause the video, you'll find the word Neurozyme somewhere. This is crazy. This is insane. Oh my 
god. Oh, virus just disappeared. Virus just disappeared out of nowhere. I don't trust the computer right now. I was about to start the next computer virus, but then this happened, the blue screen of death. Now I have to reinstall Windows from scratch. And when you do this, it deletes every single file you initially had on your computer. So this is not an actual solution. The next computer virus is called J1007-2115. I don't know why it's given that name, but it's made it to this far in the list. Run as administrator. Do you want to allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? J1007 plus 2115. Shout out to Pankoza. This is malware run. Yes. Are you sure it will overwrite the boot record and contains flashing lights? Not for the epileptic. Yes. Oh, went straight to the point. Oh, bro. This is an actual nightmare. Oh my god, PC, looking up, actual computer screen right now. Bro, this is a nightmare. Oh, what is all this? <laughs> what is all this fab? Oh my god, dog, this is what my actual PC looks like right now. This is not a joke. I'm always worried that when I open these computer viruses that the actual virus is gonna leak onto my PC and every single file that I know and love is going to be damaged. I always worry about that. Always. Dude, what the hell? Oh my god, your device ran into a problem and needs to restart. And I'm guessing that it destroyed the boot sector of the computer. And of course, uh, yeah, it's telling me to reinstall Windows from scratch. Bonzi Buddy versus subscribe virus. Disconnect from my internet. Keep forgetting to do that. So first I ran the top G of top G's, Bonzi Buddy. And after he arrived, he said this. I'm here to destroy your computer again. But this time, it's an actual destruction. Then he twizzled my computer from behind the scenes. But now it's time for me to run the subscribe virus. At first, it gave me an epilepsy warning. But then this happened. So Bonzi Everybody's surviving. Oh! What the hell? While the subscription virus was destroying the computer, Bonzi Buddy didn't care and he put on his sunglasses. So Bonzi Buddy is chilling there wearing sunglasses. Looks like he's smiling right now. While my computer was being ripped apart from the subscribe virus, Bonzi Buddy just started yawning from boredom, played with a butterfly, and put on his sunglasses again. But then the subscribe virus actually made Bonzi Buddy disappear. Oh, 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 where did he go? This virus then started showing me shapes that us humans can't comprehend. Oh my god, they're showing 4D shapes right now. This computer virus was actually stressing me out. I actually can't handle this one. I can't handle it. Bonzi Buddy is just yakking in the background. After about a minute, the subscribe virus just sent my PC to the afterlife. Your device just ran into a problem and needs to restart. We're just collecting some error info and then we'll restart it for you. Windows logo. Windows logo looking good. Why? The final computer virus that we're gonna open up is called the CDM virus, cdm.exe. This is malware, click yes to run, click no to exit. Click yes. Are you sure it will overwrite the boot record, disable task manager, and it contains flashing lights, not for the epileptic, yes. Straight to the point. What the hell? What the hell? I don't even have access to my computer anymore. This is what it looks like, dude. Yo, this is crazy. Oh my God. Dude, this is what my computer actually looks like right now. It's getting glitched the life out. Oh, bro, this is a nightmare. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, this is insanity! I have never seen anything like this in my entire life. Oh my goodness! Bro, the screen is bouncing around. Take something and trip to that, eh? Holy! This is insanity! This can't be legal. Bro, like all these circles just bouncing around on the screen, the screen flashing, glitching, colors, bro. Oh, what the hell? The circle's bouncing around the screen. I'm just waiting very patiently for it to hit the corner like the DVD logo. If you're enjoying what you're watching so far, go ahead and hit the like button. Ladies and gentlemen, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Put on the notification bell to be notified the next time I upload a video like this on the channel. If you guys enjoyed this video and you guys want to see another video from me, go ahead and click the thing that just appeared on the top right of the screen that's going to take you to another video of mine. I know you're going to like it because I hand-selected this video. But ladies and gentlemen, that's all for the video. Thank you guys so much. Love you.